Hey guys, how's it going? In a previous video, we have talked about on how we can set up a template and how we can render our templates. So in this video, we are going to walk through on how we can install Bootstrap in our website. So if here, if we go to getbootstrap.com, you can see that Bootstrap is basically a CSS library, which allows us to use their pre-styled component. So here, if we go to get started and the CSS section, we can just pretty much copy here and go to our to do's templates and base here we can paste our uh, script which allows us to install our uh, CSS uh, bootstrap so if we go to our server again reload and we can see that the styling is a little bit changed because we installed bootstrap in our HTML document so here I can pretty much copy and paste my script right here and it's basically just a, a navigation bar uh, which just doesn't do anything so if we go to our document and we hit refresh now we can see our uh, pretty neat navigation bar so in our home.html we can simply uh, remove this h1 tag because we don't need this anymore and we also can remove uh, here the name in our views.py and here in our home.html I can just pretty much copy and paste again right here and as always you can uh, actually use any styling you want or maybe if you don't want to use bootstrap that's fine but here I just uh, you know pretty much copy and paste what I have and we reload and here we can see that we have our uh, to-do list so I can also create a form for creating a new to-do by uh, go to here and we pretty much copy and paste again so this is basically a form which allows us to create a new to-do so if we uh, reload and here we can see our uh, form uh, which have the input and also the create to do submit button so if we go to our base.html again and here we can create a new container which allows us to add a padding into our content so we reload and here we get a nice padding so cool yeah uh, to make sure that our about page is also working so yeah that's working and one thing that I want to tell you is if you go to base.html here to create a link between pages you can simply use this but there is a more a convenient way to create a link so here I can say URL like this and our route name which is home and here we also can use this tag also uh, but this is is about so the reason why we use this is because whenever our routes change in the urls.py so whenever we want to change this into maybe about me like this or maybe uh, something other you can simply use this name inside your template so uh, it's very convenient and also consistent so uh, here we also can change this into a URL tag so here URL home again so if we go to our browser hit refresh and the about page is still working and the to do's page is still working so cool yeah so that's it for the bootstrap installation uh, and you actually pretty much can use any styling if you want but just make sure that you have in your home.html you have a form which have an input with the type of text and the name is title and also you have a button which type submit and it's simply to create a to-do and also you need to render all of or all of your to-dos list right here and you can basically use anything as long as you can show them the to-dos and also you have this uh, button which can delete and edit a to-do uh, and you use a anchor tag to do that so 
that's it for the bootstrap installation see you guys in the next video